Taryn, it's hard to imagine what this young man has been through. Yes, and you know, the keloids explained us raised dense scars that really have spread over most of his body are really hard to look at. So when you watch this story, just imagine being forced to live with it. Well, it's hard to even like to even get people to understand what I'm dealing with. But when Devonte Stewart reveals the massive bulging keloids, the scarring that has spread over the majority of his body, they start to understand. Devonte says the scarring started off small when he was just seven years old. Me being a kid, I scratched the chicken pox off, and um, I woke up the next morning and I had little bubbles over my whole body. A Detroit doctor convinced Devante's mother they should have the small scars surgically removed all at once, which they quickly learned was a big mistake. It did not work, and they all came back in the stitch form, and they have been getting bigger over time. Devante shows us pictures and videos of how they have been growing and now merging ever since. You know, it's spiraling out of control. It's over 75% of my body already. And it's continuing to grow in. Like, I'm, I'm scared for my life. The Detroit man has worked as a certified nursing assistant, but because of the keloids that limit his mobility now, the 29 year old says his nursing home job became too strenuous. He recently moved with his wife and two young kids to attend the Universal Technical Institute in Illinois to become a diesel mechanic, but had to quit because of the physical work. Devante has recently sought help from the New York office of Dr. Michael Jones, one of the leading cosmetic and reconstructive surgeons in the country, who is known for his radiation treatment of keloids. I showed her and she said, yeah, like, you know, they could, she told me that they could help me. In fact, the doctor told him it was 90% effective. Unfortunately, the procedure that impacts the cells is considered cosmetic and insurance won't cover it. A GoFundMe account has been started to help raise the funds for the procedures, expected to cost thousands of dollars. But at this point, Devante says it's his only hope. I'm just scared about all of it because it's, it, it's, it's not like I just got keloids, but I got keloids just continuing to grow. And Devante has tried other treatments and he wears compression garments, but says nothing has helped. We put a link to his GoFundMe page on our website, fox2detroit.com. He says any help would be appreciated. Monica. Oh, your heart just breaks for this man. Mm. So this New York doctor, can his treatment prevent these keloids from coming back? Well, we're told to 90% success rate. And Devante says the doctors there did tell him that when he had a telehealth uh, consultant meeting there with them. But researching this doctor, it appears that he has donated his services in the past. So maybe he will see the story mm -hmm. and want to help Devante too because he really has come through with this treatment that seems to be very effective, especially treating large keloids like this.